Hello, friend. Welcome. This is our existing uh, Java project for chess uh, developed in Eclipse. Okay, in this video, we'll try to put the source code of the chess project under uh, Git control and we'll put it in the GitHub public domain. Okay, so I already created a, a URL for uh, the GitHub repository for chess Java. Okay, so now let's make a copy of this URL. Okay, now we need to go to you don't need to do that. So uh, we need to create our new repository, add a new repository here and uh, right click, paste repository path or URI. Okay, so let's paste it here. Oh, it's already here. Yeah, Eclipse is smart. It put this, um, the, the, the content in my clipboard, right? <laughs> Automatically here. So host uh, GitHub. Okay, so this one is chess repository pass. Yes. Nice. That's what we need. Next. And uh, master develop. Okay, so branches of the um, let's focus on this branch, master branch only. Next. And finish. Okay, so we have our, yeah, we have this branch he here, this new repository, Java Chess, okay? Chess Java. Now we can go back to and actually you can do it here. So right click this one and uh, go to the team. Okay, so wait a minute. Let's go back switch to this one. After we created the repository entry, right? In the uh, Git perspective, now we can go to here, our normal Java perspective and uh, right click here and select team share project. Then we can select the repository here, chess, Java, okay, and uh, finish. Cool. Now we need to push the existing code, right, to the remote GitHub repository, so Let's bring up this one. Oh, everything here is new because we haven't pushed anything yet. Now add all of them here. Um, so that's, yeah, you, you see here, we, we, we include all the images, right? Those cool, like chess piece images inside this, this package. Now, um, what is the message we want to put here and um, submit submit it um, existing chess project um, on to git hub repo okay so commit and push close now look at here here is the here is the the web page for the github right so let's refresh it so here we have only three things here you see initial oh let's refresh that wow you see 
we have the new thing here right everything will be here images you see nice right so if you need those images to play with you can go there and uh, white queen here so enjoy i will post this i will post the url of this uh github repository on the description of our um video now let's try to add something new here and uh, okay so let's stop it here and rerun it to make sure this is our okay so here is our entry point the main function the main method of this project now everything is under uh, git control so cool oh we <laughs> we draw two pieces here already but remember um we have a uh, from our connect for project we know right if we close here yeah the app is still inside our uh, computer's memory that's bad we want uh, to change this behavior to something like when we close the window we quit the um the app itself so we can do here like um frame dot set default close operation right we can use this constant j frame dot like exit on close right now let's try it again run it and when we close the window it will stop the app by itself okay close yeah gone cool right so another thing we can do is we want to follow a good naming convention um so we'll re rename this one to our controller okay so because we'll use the yeah right click here wait a minute so here this guy right right click refactoring refactor rename this will be our chess controller controller we'll use model view mvc model view design pattern right so this is our controller we don't have the uh, the model yet so this will be our view right this is our view so let's rename it to chess view rename chess view okay and uh, let's create our model even though um, new we can put a like a skeleton here class chess model now we have all of them right model view controller model view controller so that's leave it empty for now and uh, stop it make sure every everything is still working so let's put this one model model oh i just yeah so model model view controller okay model view controller make sure we didn't break anything yeah it works and now we can make a commit for this change so let's switch to git uh, perspective now we can add all the changes to here and uh, 
we named Java files or Java classes. We have a a file for each, right? A single file for each um class. We name the Java classes following MVC um, pattern. Okay. Now commit and push. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching. See you next time.